Daniela, you're tuned into Layout TV, and today I'm here with issue 11 feature, Jolie. So you saw a bit of her profile in our last issue, and today we're going to find out a bit more about this artist. So Jolie, you had your, your into acoustic genre, the acoustic yep. genre. What made you go into this genre? It's not very, it's quite rare for young artists to yeah. get into this genre, so what um, made you interested? What? As from a really young age, like I liked singing, mm -hmm. and um, I listened to a lot of like Taylor Swift, and so it kind of got me towards the kind of acoustic. Yeah. Vibe. Yeah. Okay. And then later came the guitar. So how did you go about introducing this into your music? Well, we decided to start learning acoustic guitar rather than electric or bass because it would be a good way to sort of start off and start putting it to my songs. Mm -hmm. So from the age of about nine or ten, I started learning acoustic. Okay, and would electric guitar or bass guitar be something you'd want to get, look into in the future? Electric, yes, because um, they do some more kind of rocky songs, mm -hmm. that kind of thing. Okay, and we've had a look at some of your covers that you've done to date, yep. and they tend to vary with like chart music or yeah. pop music. How do you go about choosing which covers you're going to do? Um, well, most of my songs I get from the charts, mm -hmm. so I go on to Google and I search for the chords. Yeah. And um, once you're playing it, it kind of comes naturally, like the change from chart music to acoustic music. Mm -hmm. And so you just play it through and see how you can change it. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. So is music something you'd want to look into later as a career, do you think? I definitely hope so. Yeah. Yes. And whereabouts do you, where do you want it to take you? Um, in the future, I'd quite like to be around people that like music and um, be able to write and sing for a living. Yeah. Okay, so at this time of the year, there's a lot of Christmas songs yeah. around at the moment. <laughs> do you tend to like the old traditional ones that come out every year, or do you want to see some new material? Um, out? Well, the new songs tend to be sort of chart and sort of dance music, which in some cases is good, but I think for Christmas, I'd rather the traditional ones that yeah. I can sing to. Okay. Do you have any favourites? Well, the Slade ones. Yeah. <laughs> sort of beat and stuff. Okay. If you were to do your own Christmas song, what kind of what elements would you have in there? Um, Probably definitely happy and uh, with a nice sort of chorus that's catchy and everyone can celebrate. Yeah. 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 And obviously artists are competing for that number one spot. Yeah. <laughs> is there any favourites out there that you want to get that spot at the moment? Um, not an X Factor. Yeah. I mean, just because it's every year. But um, uh, I think a traditional one. Yeah. And not, again, like a happy one would mm -hmm. be good. So, do you want to introduce yourself to our audience? Okay, uh, my name is Jolie and uh, this song is called Feel So Good. Um, it's just about being happy and feeling on top of things. Exactly how it 